Hey guys, uh, we actually just got done with our 11 a.m. worship set, and it was cool because kind of the theme of the whole morning was geared towards the worthiness of Jesus. We were singing uh, this song, Cody Carnes' final word, and in that song, one of the last lines that we sing is, he's traded death for eternal life. The cross has the final word. And the Lord just began to speak to us in the moment at our 9 a.m. service, just about that phrase and about the fact that literally Jesus gave everything for the ones that he wants to be with. And so when we come into the place of worship, it just changes our perspective when we think of things that way. Because we don't think of, of it through the lens of, do I like this song or do, do I like the musicians on stage or the singers on stage or the style of it? But it, it totally takes all of those things out of the picture and, and just brings a remembrance to our mind of what Jesus has done for us and why we worship in the first place. And it makes it to where whatever expression you worship, whether it's hands lifted up, whether you're not lifting your hands at all, whether your eyes are closed, eyes are open, whether you're singing, shouting, you're, you're, you're praying in a whisper, whatever the expression is, we just come in the place of worship and bring our heart to the Lord because he's worthy of it and it's a beautiful thing because it makes it to where it doesn't have to look a certain way or feel a certain way but we worship because he's worthy and it makes it so simple because we can just get all of our opinions and preferences out of the way and worship Jesus because he's worthy of it uh, the one who created us who who made us who sustains us wants to have relationship with us and then gave everything unto that he gave everything unto that purpose and so when we come to the place of worship it, it just makes it simple it just makes it simple to take everything else out of the way and just enjoy Jesus for who he is and worship him because he's worthy. And so take that for what it's worth. I hope that encourages you. I hope that inspires you this week as you're worshiping, uh, as you turn on the radio and hear a song. Uh, I just challenge you, if you hear a song that's not your favorite song, if you turn on the radio and you're like, man, I don't like that song, I'm gonna switch it until a song comes on, don't do that. Stick with that song and think about the lyrics of the song. Find the lyrics in the song that point you to Jesus and sing them to him because he's worthy, not because it's your favorite song or because it's something that you like to hear. And so take that and run with it this week. I hope it encourages you. I hope that your relationship with Jesus grows because of that. And bring that attitude every time we come on Sundays. Just come ready to engage with the Lord because he's worthy of it. He's worthy of praise and he's worthy of our affection. So have an awesome week. Thankful for you guys. Love you guys. Be blessed.